Welcome back. In this video, we are going to talk about audio ducking inside CapCut and Audacity. If you don't know about the Audacity, that is open source free software on MacBook and PC, you can download and use it. I will provide all the links in this video description. What is audio ducking? Whenever you are speaking something in your video, then the background music volume goes down. But whenever you turn silent, the background music will automatically go up to a certain level of dbs wherever you set it for example my background music during the pause time will be minus 17 db then i can set it and throughout my video that volume will stay there and whenever i'm speaking that volume will go to maybe minus 4 db minus 6 db 5 db or whatsoever the value i set so i'm gonna talk about two three methods for an existing video or you can also record your audio inside audacity so let's go to the laptop screen and there we can see how we do these changes there inside CapCut and audacity all right so we are going to test two or three methods then the first one is let's say this is a video and i created complete video but i just want a background music in this video what i can do i can just go to export and here i can export only audio file and make sure that is wav file and i'm going to rename it as a test file and select the destination and then export hit export button and here is another file i just want to replace this one all right so here we got an audio file and this is test music i'm gonna place it there now you just need to go to this website and this is audacityteam.org here you can download for windows mac and linux this is open source free software as i discussed earlier so here i'm gonna delete all these projects first go to file open and here we created a test music and this is the test wav file this is the whole bunch of audio file this video contains inside my CapCut. all right so here i can mute this project for a while and keep it there now just go to audacity and here you can bring audio file background music here are some of the files i'm gonna drag them to my audacity just drop this file here and now hold this place and bring it upside now the background music is here and this is my original audio if i play you can go to the bottom right corner and all right so this is fine now just select this audio by clicking here or you can also select like this just select this one go to effects and now you just go to this volume and compression and here is auto duck once you select this one here are two or three options this is a fade in this is fade out you can select it up to one second that is all right and 98 95 it's up to your requirement just like 95 is all right and here is the background music volume minus 17 db works better for me you can check your device whatever the suitable background music volume is there so after that you can also preview and i'm not gonna go for further details about this one you can check around this setting go apply and you can see that the background music volume automatically decreases in this audio file you will hardly see that there is any space empty space for the audio ducking and for this track you already did and now you can bring other tracks one two three and this you know whole file will be there as one clip now you can just go to a file and export as mp3 or wave file i'm gonna go for mp3 and this is test for cap cut video done i can choose the place and now save and hit ok now go to cap cut and import this audio file this one click import and now this audio has audio ducking in the background as you can see if i play from the start creator and a lot of rewards and gifts and there is an important thing as you can see it's quite easy this was just for the CapCut existing audio existing video and now we're gonna record our audio ourselves just go to audacity again i'm gonna delete these projects and make sure that you are on the right microphone and here you can choose the recording is an external microphone is here and this one is a playback and now i can press a record button and i will leave some pauses and silences so that you can easily understand what i'm doing hello this is a test to check how audio ducking in audacity and CapCut works 
I'm leaving some pauses to check the background music volume through the audio ducking. Alright, so this audio has been recorded. Now I'm gonna go for the files again and here I'm gonna choose this one, drag it to the audacity and now drag this one upside and this is background music. This is my voiceover. I can bring it here. Now by selecting this one, you can delete extra parts as well like this is unnecessary for me. Now just selecting this one, go to effects and go to volume auto dock here is the setting i discussed earlier about this setting you can choose whatever suits your needs boom here you go here you can see that whenever i'm taking some pauses the background volume is higher like this place and whenever i'm speaking the background volume is lower so let's play and see hello this is a test to check how audio ducking in audacity and cut cut works i'm leaving some pauses to check the background music volume through the audio ducking all right so whenever i'm speaking the volume is down whenever i'm not speaking the volume is up this is how you can easily do audio ducking now you can easily export this file as a wave or mp3 or aac whatsoever audio file you need and import it into any video project wherever you want you can also deal with voiceovers in this software i'm gonna bring new stuff about this audacity there are a lot more things about audio cleaning and background noise remover and so many things are there so i'll see you next one if you didn't subscribe subscribe today bye